Welcome back to the El Yucateco YouTube channel, everybody. My name is Mike, and today we'll be doing an easy, smoked, cheesy chicken dip that you're absolutely gonna love, and it's coming up right now. Welcome back to the channel once again. We really appreciate having you here, and if you haven't subscribed yet, we would really appreciate you hitting that button down there and clicking the bell to get notifications anytime we release new content. Now, as always, all the details for this recipe will be down in the description box for ingredients and directions, as well as all the social media links for El Yucateco. Now, without any further ado, let's get right into this recipe. For starters, for this recipe, you're gonna need some pulled and chopped rotisserie chicken or any pre-cooked chicken will be fine. You can do it on the grill, you can do it in the oven, whatever works best for you. We have one block of cream cheese, some chopped tomatoes with green chilies, your favorite brand of ranch dressing, some shredded cheddar cheese. We've got some chopped cilantro here. We're gonna use some of this in the dip and reserve a little bit for garnish. And last, but certainly not least, we're gonna be using some El Yucateco Red for this recipe. Now to start this off, we need to put a little melt on all these ingredients to get them to combine. So we're gonna put all this into a nonstick pot. And now my favorite ingredient. Our sauces are great condiments, but they also go great as ingredients in dishes just like this. Now we'll get this on the stove just for a few minutes to get everything melted down. Then it'll be time to transfer it to a baking dish and out to the smoker it goes. I'll be smoking this today at a temperature of about 275 degrees Fahrenheit. And we're just gonna let it go until we get some nice bubbling around the edges. Now let's get this onto the stove to get everything melted and combined. The smell is already incredible. By the way, I did go ahead and spray this baking dish with some nonstick before I transferred the dip into it. It is now time to get this outside onto the smoker. I've got my smoker preheated to about 275 degrees Fahrenheit and we'll be putting this on for about an hour to get some good smoke, some bubbling around the edges, and then we'll garnish it and give it a taste test. Now I'm warning you, it is very cold. We've had a lot of snow and ice out here lately, so make sure you get bundled up. Let's get outside to the smoker. So that only took about 45 minutes to get some good smoke on here and to get that bubbling around the edges that we're looking for. We're back inside where it's warm, which is nice, but it's gonna get even better because we're about to do a taste test. Just look at how beautiful that is. Now I like to serve my dips with rounds because it's easier to scoop. Cheers, everybody. Mmm. It's creamy, it's cheesy, it's savory, it's delicious, and that El Yucateco Red really added a lot to this dish. We got a lot of flavor and we did get a nice little kick on the end of the bite. So listen, I hope you'll make this recipe at home. All the details will be down below. I really appreciate your time and hanging out with me today. Take care till next time. I'll see you on the next video.